what it do baby so we're back and today i thought i would do kind of something different um we will be doing a blind water taste test right now my boyfriend is in the kitchen getting all the waters together we have nine different waters uh to include tap water and then uh what i normally drink which is pure filtered water on the day-to-day -day, so i don't have to buy a whole bunch of bottled water and then we have seven miscellaneous bottled waters um, to go through. So I thought it would be fun to see if I can differentiate waters between brands. Um, so I did a little bit of research on each of the waters just to see what kind of claims that they have, like what their uh, purification process is, if they are pH balanced, all of that good stuff. So I'm really excited to do this. Um, it's kind of lame, but I like to think of myself kind of like a, a water connoisseur because that's really all I drink on a day-to-day -day basis. And I can usually tell the difference between tap water and filtered water or at least bottled water. So this should be interesting uh, to see how good my skills are in differentiating whether it's tap water, bottled water, special fancy water or whatever okay, so so as you can see we have all the waters lined up and they're accompanying water bottles so already you can see that number nine is not like the rest it is sparkling water and um that is the boss water it says clearly says sparkling um well, if, if it would focus, it would say sparkling. So now um, that is automatic. Like I already know what that one is, which is fine. It, you know, whatever. I will still give my review on the Voss water. And it came in a, a glass bottle, which is kind of cool. Um, yeah. And then also this water is different than all the rest. And none of the other ones are sparkling waters. So I'm interested into seeing what that one is and what it tastes like. I'm going to go ahead and do the first taste test of the number nine or the Voss just to see what it's like. So my boyfriend is in the back and he's going to tell me whether I got it right or wrong um, in my association with these waters versus their bottled counterparts and he's not going to tell me how many i got wrong or right until the end so here we go so this is the number nine or the boss sparkling water and i like sparkling water this is okay i don't particularly drink plain sparkling water a lot I usually drink flavored sparkling water but this is not bad it's very smooth it tastes clean it's got a nice little bubble um yeah I, if I was you know at the store and I saw that I would definitely pick it up so now moving to number one actually getting into this taste test there we go so Gotta swirl it and sniff it <laughs> like you do a fine wine. Um, it looks clear. It doesn't have any noticeable scent or anything. So go ahead and taste it. All right, so this is gonna be hard. I already know because this just tastes like water. Um, it is really smooth. It has like a nice buttery type of feeling on your tongue. And um, for this one, for right now, I am going to say that it's smart water. I don't know, but for some reason, that's the vibe I'm getting from it. I have drinking, drank smart water before and it's kind of, kind of reminiscent of that, I guess. All right, moving on to number two.
I do have to remember that there's also the pure and the tap water in here. So yeah, no noticeable bad smell. It does have like a different smell though, which is weird when you think about water. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't have like a, a different taste but it definitely isn't as smooth as the number one so just off of random whatever because this is a cool bottle i'll just say that this is life water so now moving to number three which has these weird bubbles which makes me feel like it is tap water but who knows it might be Dasani, honestly, but none of these taste different. The only difference is like the mouthfeel, and for some reason, this makes my mouth feel dry, which doesn't make sense because it's water. So I'm gonna say that this is Dasani just because the Dasani has bubbles in it. I don't know, there's no logic to this at all. All right, now we're moving to number four. Oh, I didn't even smell this one. I don't know if it's the lip gloss that I'm wearing that I'm smelling or if it's the water that smells kind of funny. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna stick that one with Dasani though. Oh, this one's terrible. This actually has a bad taste. Um, yeah, no, I don't like that one at all. I'm gonna say this is Aquafina because I don't care for Aquafina. It's either Aquafina or if it's or it's tap water. Um, it has a significant, a significantly different taste, which is very weird. So I'm gonna say that it's the Aquafina or tap. We'll see. Moving on to number five. This one has that same weird taste. So I'm gonna say that this one is Dasani. So four and five are either Aquafina and Dasani or they're tap water. That's where I'm at right now, we'll see. Moving to number seven. This one has that same weird little smell to it. I don't know, I don't know. So this one doesn't have a, a taste. I'm going to say that this is the pure filtered water. I'm going to put this here. And the last one. So I haven't given these anything yet, which I'm not sure what that means. So yeah, okay. Doesn't have a smell, doesn't have a taste. It's just refreshing water. So let me think. I already know number nine is Voss because that's the only sparkling water. I am going to say that maybe number one is Evian. And then number three, no, not number three is smart water. No, number three is tap water. Pause, pause, pause. What? Just pause it. 
Y'all, so we had to take a quick intermission because there was one missing. And I don't know how I didn't realize that when I did the little lineup. But number six, we have another one, which makes sense that they're, because something wasn't adding up. But here we are. So let's see, it's number six. This smells soapy. Okay. Oh, God! No! <laughs> this has to be the one. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is terrible. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Okay. So that means I'm feeling more confident in my assessment that four or five are Aquafina and Dasani. Um, Essentia. I don't know. I'm assuming that this just tastes like regular water. So I'm going to say that that's eight. Uh, <laughs> uh, for some reason, I felt like if I shook it, I would know if it was number three or not. I'm going to say that number three is smart water. Number six is definitely tap water. And then number seven is the pure filtered water. So... <laughs> All right, hold one second so I can show you all the last little lineup and then we will evaluate how I did. Okay, so hold up. Y'all, this is my final lineup and I will give my last thoughts um, after my boyfriend Deontay finishes tallying up how many I got wrong, how many I got right, which is probably none of them, except for the tap water. Uh, six, I feel like is the tap water. Seven, I feel like is the pure water. All right, so we're back. Um, we're about to see if I got any of these right, which I'm not feeling super confident. I was literally just throwing stuff around. So go ahead, Deontay, drum roll. <laughs> Yeah. One. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, other than Boston, but I'm not counting. And so. the one that I got right was number six. Yeah. Yeah, no, that was terrible. Was terrible. I, at least I know what tap water is. But the rest of them, okay. So what was number one? Number one was life water. When okay. you first tasted it, you said it was smart water. Then at the end, you said e EBM. <laughs> okay. So life water. Okay. Number two. Number two was Aquafina. When you first tasted it, you said it was like water. At the end, you said it was like water. Oh, okay, okay. So I was wrong on that. So maybe I do kind of like uh, Aquafina. Number three was Dasani. At first, you thought. Oh, it was Dasani, I knew it. Because these dang on bubbles. <laughs> I knew it. I okay. Switch. You had it. But Terrible. Okay, number four. Right, number four was smart water. At first you thought it was Aquafina or tap water, and then you said it was Aquafina. <laughs> so I clearly don't really care for smart water. Number five was Essentia. At first you thought it was Dasani or tap, and then at the end you said it was Dasani. Yeah, it's not very, it's not a very, like, it, I don't know what alkaline water is supposed to taste like, but it doesn't taste different from any other water. So at this point, it's like, don't even spend extra money on these name brand waters when they claim all these crazy things. You can't tell the difference. Okay. Number six was tap. At uh, first you thought it was tap, and you got it right because <laughs> it was tap. <laughs> And number seven was Evian, Evian, whatever. Oh, you really? Uh, you thought it was the pure filter? Yeah. At first, and then at the end, you thought it was a pure filter. Uh huh. What did I think number eight was? Number eight was the pure filter. You said you, at first, you thought it was Essentia, and then at the end, you said it was Essentia. So. Gotcha. And okay. I was false because I bought sparkling water after that. <laughs> yeah. I mean,. You know, like these waters aren't going to go to waste or whatever, but well, okay. The Dasani might. 
Uh, Use his belts. Yeah, but um, mm -hmm. the other ones, I mean, hey, if you like or can tell the difference between all of these fancy waters, you know, good on you, but obviously I can't. I'm not the water connoisseur that I thought I was. So, um, yeah, that's it for the video, guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see y'all next week. Um, God willing, I have another video idea. <laughs> Peace out, y'all.